You know, honestly, I have no idea where to begin this video, but I guess uh, first off, starting off with my introduction. So what is going on, guys? It's Bato here, not Beto, not Betro, fucking monkey, Bato. And I'm uh, coming back to you guys with a brand new video today. And uh, today I'm going to be explaining a ton of things that's going to be coming to my channel uh, possibly in the future. Well, actually, I'm going to start now. I'm going to do it now but there's some things that have been going around like that i've been talking about on twitter if you follow me on twitter you already know everything that's been happening and shit like that if you don't here is my twitter right here so you know follow me and you can keep up with me and everything so, uh updates on what the next video is gonna be and just you know how i'm doing i can reply to you guys whatever so you know just follow me if you feel like it i also do have a snapchat and instagram they're both on the screen as well now for this video i'm gonna have the ratings most likely disabled i'm not sure if i'm gonna keep the comments disabled or enabled as well but I'm gonna be talking about a couple of things. So first off, let me break the first thing down to you, okay? So if you guys know my avatar that I have on every single, usually I used to have it on every single video, but I have it on my profile pictures and everything. It's the little cartoon guy with the curly hair and stuff like that. I've had him for about two years, you know? I've always used him, it was kinda cool. I put him on apparel. I'm gonna be uh, taking him off. I'm not gonna be having him on my channel anymore, so RIP uh, old AVI. I'm gonna actually jump forward into my channel instead of doing what I do now. I'm gonna try to jump into the future a little bit not jump into the future but kind of pull myself more to the like I guess you could say to the top not really to the top but more like push myself to do even harder than I already do now and if you know me and YouTube I work very very hard on YouTube I try to make the content as best as I can I try to put the thumbnails as professional as they can the intros the outros that's why I like getting your guys' opinions because you know we're all in it together so I want everything to be something everyone agrees on but I'm gonna be jumping ahead I'm gonna be pushing myself even harder because I'm not sure that I'm gonna be doing YouTube that much longer anymore. I know the haters are gonna be like, yeah, dude, we achieved it, we disliked, yo, we did the hate, he's leaving, yeah. That's not really the specific reason. I've always loved haters, honestly. I've been bullied my entire life, so I've learned to deal with haters. Haters don't really get to me ever, especially with the like bar. You know, people try to leave a ton of dislikes or dislike bot me or something. I usually don't focus on the dislikes and likes. It's mostly uh, dislikes to people who probably didn't enjoy the content, which pushes me to improve. It's people who just dislike like me in general and I can't do anything to improve it so that's like another reason why I don't care for the dislike and the likes but if you follow me on Twitter you do know that I'm more than likely okay just more than likely it's not super positive yet I'm still coming to a decision on this as well I kind of kind of faded out today where I was like yeah I'm actually not gonna do this you know I'm gonna keep going shit like that but if you follow me on Twitter you know that I was gonna quit YouTube in about a month or so if you know also my mom won't let me get a job because I'm in school right now that's why I can't get a job because I am in school and I haven't graduated yet she wants me to graduate first before I get a job and I can basically graduate whenever I want I already have everything done I can just click send I have been ready to graduate since like sophomore year I've been very far to my head ahead of my work but I just been holding off that way I can pursue my dream of YouTube and you know that's why I haven't graduated yet because I'm not ready to go for a job yet I really want to pursue this YouTube thing and I know that when I get a job basically won't have time for YouTube and I'm gonna have to give it up because this is my dream guys I really want to be a YouTuber and yeah it did start off as a hobby and then I thought about it like I can I really enjoy this I really love it I love the people that support me I love putting the effort into the content I love playing the games meeting you guys making the thumbnails thumbnails is probably like one of my favorite parts actually I love putting crazy shit together and fucking with everything and I was like I could possibly make a living out of this like people actually have done it and I know I can do it and all I have to do is just put more time than I do now and I've put so much time into my YouTube you guys actually know I barely ever leave my room my mom tells me all the time like I never see you you never come out of your room I don't even know who my son is anymore but that's because I'm always on my computer I'm always trying to think of ideas I'm always trying to make my thumbnails more professional learn how to edit better how to get everything better as possible hit more clips for you guys so I can make more more montages and you know make more montages and be in my dream clan phase and stuff like that even though they don't hit clips anymore it's all about content creator but it's you know it's just a dream everyone has a dream that's like my second dream though my first dream is to pursue youtube my second dream is to join phase i'm not really the one to want to go to college and stuff like that even though there is a college called itt tech that i could go to and learn more about computers and stuff like that but i 
really do not want to go to college. I already hate school enough as it is. But like I was saying, okay, so I could graduate whenever I want and time is running out because I want to graduate the time I'm a senior and I am a senior now. I could have graduated as a sophomore, but I was like, I can do a two year delay and no one would really know. I mean, everybody already knows. I already told them I could graduate whenever I want. I'm just chilling and time is running out. Senior year is going to end and I can actually graduate before senior year even ends. And I kind of don't want to do that. Honestly, I kind of want to finish uh, before December, before my birthday, that I can get everything done on my birthday. They'll do the graduation. I'll get my certificate. I'll get everything. So the time I graduate, I'm going to be getting a job most likely and my dream job <laughs> believe it or not I want to work at GameStop I want to work at things that have to do with video games things to keep me you know happy and stuff like that that way when I wake up in the morning I can't do YouTube so I might as well do something that is related to video games so I want to pursue you know my dream of working with video games which is you know GameStop that's the closest thing I can think of right now so as soon as I get my job I've talked to a, a friend about this if I don't know if you guys ever heard of him he's a youtuber with like 200,000 subs his name is Overt Flow I talk to him all the time on Twitter I guess you could say we're just kind of friends not really too close but we talk a lot on twitter and he told me like gamestop is a really good place to work it's like a really good place you get discounts and stuff like that you work closer with video games and shit and i was like dude that's dope i'm really looking forward to this now so the day i graduate which is more than likely going to be like next month or probably in december because there's actually an elective i'm taking which is <laughs> chess honestly believe it or not i'm taking chess to get a free elective credit and i'm good at chess with so a free elective credit which doesn't end till december so i might not be done till december but i don't know it's going to be very soon i might be able to get him quick because I'm already like I'm really good at it I could probably already pass but as soon as I graduate I'm gonna have to get a job and I'm gonna work at GameStop more than likely and having you know having a job and stuff like that having to wake up early go to the job come home possibly exhausted which I more than likely will I fucking work with fucking games dude I'm more than likely not gonna have time for YouTube and not focus on it as much as I am now like now I have all my attention on YouTube I go to school and then I come home and I just do YouTube. That's all I do. I focus more on YouTube. You can ask my friends. You can ask my girlfriend. You can ask my mom, my brother, anything. YouTube is what I pursue. This is what I want to do. This is what I'm trying to do. I'm not getting very far in it. And it's just, you know, there's no reason to give up. You just keep going. And that's what I've always seen it. You know, I have the most inactive subscribers on YouTube, more likely. I have 10,000 subs and I barely break 200, 300 views a video. And people think I sub bot, honestly, but I don't. I really don't. It's, uh, if you've been around since the beginning, I made a lyric video, okay, called Ill Minor Hobson 7. I'll post it on the screen now. That way you guys know I still have it. It's private though. I made it private so I don't get subs from the music video anymore. But I made it private at like 10 5k so it's like barely subs are going from me now but i made a video and it got like thousands of subscribers thousands of likes from me i even checked where subscribers are coming from they're coming from that video and people are subscribing to me because they want music videos they want lyrics they think i'm making that song or hobson you know some people are like oh wow congrats bro nice song but they think i made it but hobson made it so i get subscribers people subscribe to me people thought i was making music but i really wasn't i was just a guy making gaming content and no one wanted to check that out they subscribed because they thought i was a music video thing but I'm obviously not so they never I don't know why for some reason they never unsubscribed which doesn't make any sense but I mean that's where my subscribers are I mean as far as I know I haven't bought anything I haven't bought subscribers I've never done any of that shit if someone is possibly fucking doing that to me just please stop but as far as I know there are no bot subscribers coming to my channel it's just people who probably see me from like phase adapt or something like that They're like oh that's cool subscribe they watch one video and it's probably a shitty video I made or something like that because there's those days right you know make a shitty video because it's late at night and I got to get to bed and then they're like oh okay I'll just stay sub you know I'm not gonna watch this content and that, that's those are the people that I want to unsubscribe you know people who just want the you know good videos not people who are trying to support me but you know there's really no reason to give up because eventually I'm gonna get to that moment where people start coming into the good videos and the better ones and more people group in and that's where I'm gonna start growing but like I was saying though by the time that I get my job and everything I'm not gonna be able to do YouTube anymore so I'm more than likely gonna have to quit YouTube uh, by the end of the year or something like that and that's something I really don't want to do and something I really want to do is pursue this and I've tried everything I can I've made montages I made videos on things that everyone's talking about I've tried clickbait I've tried uh, 1v1s I've tried covers I've tried everything there is possible I even tried to make my own series called hashtag Bato short parodies it's called BSP you can look it up in the pa in the playlist and that's like my own little series of funny things it actually gets really uh, popular actually I think each of them have like a thousand views or something like that but you know people always say like you need original you need to be original on YouTube that's how you're gonna make it be true to yourself you know that's gonna make it on YouTube well here we are 10,700 subscribers later and only break 200 views a video I guess people don't want originality people don't want people who are real people will get mad at me because they say I'm an asshole they say like bro you're a dick you know like I'm not a dick I'm just true I'm straightforward I say whatever is on my mind and it like it says in my bio I speak my mind if I offend you 
that's cool i don't care or something like that doesn't mean i'm a total asshole i mean i have nice in me for my mom because that's how my mom is she's a really really good person and that's where i get my goodness from but that's how i am you know i'm true to people i'm true to my fans i'm true to everyone people say i'm fake but i'm really not like there's actually a fan who really hates on me right now honestly it's, it, i'm not gonna name him but this is going straight to him okay he said he snapchats me uh, all the time okay and i get a ton of snapchats okay not just from fans you know i get them from fans i get them from friends i get them just from random fucking people who <laughs> probably find me on twitter or something like that or instagram because i do post on twitter and instagram and be like snapchat me i'm bored legit usually every time i check my snapchat i only check it like once a day twice a day and i get like maybe 20 snapchats that's like the most i get not really too much but enough right and i'll go through i'm just like clicking it i click it i click it i click it and you know i don't really reply to snapchats honestly i don't reply to my i barely reply i think the only person i do reply to on snapchat is my girlfriend but she doesn't have a snapchat anymore and even when my friends send me snapchats i don't reply to them and that's what this fan is um, going against me for because i don't reply on snapchat and he says even when he asks his questions you know i don't reply and it's just because i'm going through it i'm not really trying to talk to anyone on snapchat you know i have snapchat just to have it i really don't like it that much and then he says like i'm fake and stuff like that when really that's not the case i mean i just i'm sorry if you feel that way i truly do apologize he's been around for months too he's been around forever i've seen his comments all the time and it sucks that he turned on me over something like as little as snapchat but i'm more than likely just probably gonna delete my snapchat or i'll probably probably just make it private or something because that's another thing he's beefing me about saying that it's open anyone can snapchat you but that's not really you know the thing like a lot of people have their snapchats open doesn't mean they reply like hobson has it open he doesn't reply devon terrell has it open futuristic has it open i think phase adapt does but it doesn't mean they reply to everyone you know so now to get that out of the way i'm sorry if this video is a little long i just really want to get everything into the video as much as possible so you guys understand on where i'm coming from so like i said in the beginning i'm going to be taking out my avi my little cartoon head i'm taking that out i'm changing the profile picture and i'm going to be putting this as my profile picture okay i'm going to put myself happy gaming doing whatever the fuck i want because i'm done with this shit i just want to you know do youtube put as much effort as i can i really want to just you know focus on youtube before i have to quit because that's more than likely going to happen i'm probably going to have to give up anyway doesn't really mean to unsubscribe and stop watching me because i could be around you know because people say i do make them smile and stuff like that i can be around until i leave or maybe there's just that time where out of nowhere i hit a growth spur and i fucking hit a thousand subscribers or <laughs> my bad like a hundred thousand subscribers you know fifty thousand one million like, you really never know when things are going to happen which is why i don't give up like who knew I was gonna get in that lobby with phase adapt and instantly get like what 4,000 subscribers from him and I know this title might be a little bit clickbait it's not really clickbait I think the title is gonna be like uh, you know f uh, moving forward into my channel or something like that and in parentheses it's gonna be like quitting YouTube question mark and then like uh, things I'm addressing basically it's gonna be the things I'm addressing so it's not really clickbait because I'm addressing them but that's really everything I wanted to say you know I just I'm gonna be starting fresh I'm gonna be starting over people I've had fights with I'm just done people who hate leave hate comments I'm not replying anymore i always reply to them usually for some weird reason but i'm more than likely just gonna block them if anyone leaves a hate i'm just you're getting blocked immediately i'm not dealing with that bullshit anymore if i have beef with anyone i just want to say i apologize for everything that has happened and i'm starting fresh i'm done with everything if you have beef with me i don't know what to do i i'm apologizing and i'm just gonna work solo a lot of people say like bro why don't you collab it's because i i don't collab because i like doing things my way and doing it the way that i like to go and go the direction i win not have people possibly get in the way drag me down or have them give me credit for pulling me up so i like to do it myself even though there are times where i could collab with a couple of people or something but more than likely it's really rare for me to collab but that's basically all i wanted to tell you guys in today's video you know i'm making a new avi i'm updating everything and I'm possibly going to be quitting YouTube in the future. But yeah, anyways, thank you guys for watching today's video. If you have any more questions, leave them down in the comments below and I will address them immediately because uh, there might be some more questions I'm not I'm missing out on. I love you all so fucking much and I hope you guys have a fantastic day. And uh, Bato is out. Peace.